Hey guys, Sion here with another episode of What's My Blank. Today we'll be unboxing Supreme Item. It's a Supreme Nike collaboration which dropped about two weeks ago. I wasn't a big fan. A lot of the things that Nike dropped, they had a lot of leather material. So they had like leather jacket, leather duffel bag and etc. I actually wasn't planning on getting anything but I did grab random items. So I'll show you guys what I got. Let's go. So because it was pretty random generic drop, I did debate whether I wanted to show this unboxing or not. I figure why not since I got it. I figure I'll show everything that I buy regardless of whether it's really really sought after item or not. That way you guys see and also kind of determine it for yourself whether or not you like the item even though it's generic supreme item. So here you have the three items which I got. The stuff that came with it. You have the supreme box logo. Another one. And the sticker which is world famous supreme cheese and this supreme photo of Jacob Holtz. I don't think I got this one before. I could be wrong. I know this is new so pretty cool. Nothing really exciting, nothing really unique or specific for Nike. The three items I got is the thermal pants, Hanes boxer brief, and the Nike bandana. Oh, I also got the Lush button, which I got from my previous drop this year. This is the second one that I got. So the Supreme boxer brief is pretty generic. It's hang and I got black colorway in size medium. Again, there's really nothing special about it. It's always there on the Supreme site, but I figure I'll get this one time around and see what how it is. I don't expect the quality to be crazy good. It's probably just generic Hanes quality. Let's see, you have four boxer briefs. Oh, actually, it's pretty big. I bigger than I expected. Let's take a look at one. Again, Supreme running on the top. Supreme logo on the tag inside. But other than that, it's just a boxer brief. Nothing special other than the elastic part with the Supreme logo. Um, the second item I got is the Supreme Thermal Pants. I think this is also a very generic one. Similar to the boxer brief, it has the Supreme logo on the front. In the back, same exact thing. Supreme with the SupremeNewYork.com. Give you a basic sizing information. Again, got size medium for the Thermal Pants. I bought this more specific to wear around when I'm snowboarding. Let's see if I do hold that true. But it's pretty generic Thermal Pants. It's a long pants with the Supreme red elastic this time instead of the black. Again, Supreme logo on it and the inside having the Supreme tag on it. The quality is just so-so. It's not a crazy deal. Something I got, again, just to kind of show one time thing, what it is. For a specific release for the Nike Supreme, I debated whether to get this or not. I really didn't need it, but I wanted a banana for some time for snowboarding. Even though I do get, I wear those masks usually for the tunnel neck one usually. I figured this time around I'll try to see if I could rock the banana while snowboarding. So I got the Nike one, I got the white one, I think there was the black one and I forget the other colorway but there was, they dropped in three colorway but the con color combination was not the best for me so I decided to go with the white one. At least the white was pretty generic with white and black. So we have here we go the Nike bandana. We have on the four corner the Nike box logo. Pretty dope. It's bandana but I could probably like even rock it with like just kind of hanging somewhere or whatnot so it's material is pretty thin so I'm not sure if it's gonna hold up but usually you could fold this in and then put it on for as a snowboarding gear so let me try to fold this up and show you guys how I'm gonna rock it so I usually turn it into triangle here fold it in half like this roll about an inch or two down and maybe one more hold it against and just tie it for snowboarding Usually like this. Usually I could put some fleece material in here just to make it even more warmer. But we could tie this up for snowboarding and quickly just cover your nose and mouth as you're riding down. How do you look? I don't know. Uh, this is very impulse buy for me. Uh, I really didn't need it. But uh, I figure I'll get one and see if there's another bandana that I'll rock. But let's see. I'll try a different style up and hopefully I'll rock this when I snowboard. That being said, I'll give you guys a closer look on all three items that I got and we'll wrap it up.